Episode 4 In the aerodynamic development of the new C-Class, the focus was on substantiating the sporty appeal of the car, as perceived by the customer, by means of aerodynamic properties which are as neutral as possible in terms of design. One special feature is the ventilating rear light unit. By means of a pressure gradient, air flows from the underfloor to behind the rear light unit and from here out again through slots in the surface of the rear light unit, thereby creating a specific airflow breakaway in the rear end area. This airflow routing replaces a spoiler. I just don't believe that this wind noise is caused by the mirror. Never. I just don't believe it. The guys will be thrilled. What a great steering. The return forces are high, but not so strong that you have to struggle against them. My task is to manage the overall process and the entire team, and to monitor the development of the product from the first idea through to the market launch. We have created two main lines. Comfort, in combination with dynamic handling, is the focus of one line. A decidedly sporty character combined with high comfort is the hallmark of the second. With these two lines, we want to inspire and retain our regular customers and to win over new, enthusiastic customers. In the final analysis, the system is a damper inside a damper, which we have incorporated at all four wheels. It means that we have accommodated two dampers in one unit. On an uneven road, the softer damper characteristics come into their own, meaning that the setting on rough roads is a highly comfortable one. At higher speeds and a sporty driving style, the second damper with the harder damping characteristics is activated too, as to ensure perfect tire-to-road contact. It's the sort of comfort that is fun to drive, as we put it. We have already covered many thousands of kilometers with this car, and we are highly satisfied with what we have achieved with this new system. The advanced agility package will be optionally available. This package permits both specifically comfortable and specifically dynamic motoring. At the heart of this package is the adjustable damping. It's an active system which is complemented by engine and transmission control. In the sports mode, it permits an extremely sporty driving style. This allows us to hold our own in competition. With all-out motoring pleasure in the sports mode and all the typical features of Mercedes Comfort in the Comfort mode, either mode can be had at the push of a button in the center console. A developer always wants to go on optimizing that probably runs in our veins. We always find something to optimize. But I think we can be very satisfied with the car in its present form. This is another fine-tuning round in the final stage when all the production tools are ready and our colleagues would say, that's it, let's tackle the next project. Then we have to bring them together once more and ask them to do it again. 
This is what a Mercedes is all about, and I think that's the stage we are in right now. We could now start building the car. Anyway, we have to start in January. But we'll use the time we still have and then come up with a matured and attractive product. I've driven the new C-Class over thousands of kilometers. I really look forward to this new car. For more information about the C-Class, please visit www. Mercedes-Benz.com slash C-Class This was the last episode of the C-Class video podcast. Did you enjoy the podcast? Please send an email to videopodcast at DaimlerChrysler.com